and if the dark energy density were large enough, we would hardly have had any atoms or even nuclei produced in the universe. If that prediction were correct, the universe today would have no structure, no features, no life. It would be a giant void filled with nothing but dark energy. And if the dark energy density were instead a negative 10 to the power 45 joules per cubic meter, the fate of the universe would be no more promising, as it would be forced to rapidly collapse in on itself in what's known as a big crunch. So here lies the mystery. Why is dark energy density so much lower than we predict? At the very level it needed to be at for life. Instead, we are left contemplating the marvellous nature of this cosmic coincidence. What were the odds that the energy density of dark energy would be so low when it was predicted to be so much higher? That this great universal balancing act occurred in such a way that we weren't torn apart or crushed into a singularity. Without it being so low in magnitude, we wouldn't exist. Our very atoms would have never come together torn apart by surging, expanding space. According to our predictions, we have got very lucky. This coincidence happened in such a way that the universe was able to produce life. So was it a coincidence? <laughs>